This video covers the recommendations to optimize Fortilink stack topology, resiliency and redundancy as part of the security rating optimization module in the security fabric. The example is using the Fortilink stack shown in the screen. Note that the middle switch also has a connection to FortiGate since split interface is enabled as per default setting. Security rating is reached by clicking on the little icon next to the switches, and then we enter the optimization module. There are six recommendations for FortiSwitch. Now we start by looking at those that already passed the security rating. The first one is regarding the number of switches controlled by FortiGate, showing that it's within the 80% recommended value for that specific FortiGate model. The second recommendation is regarding STP. By default, STP edge port is fully configured by the switch controller function, so it will be automatically achieved. Let's now look at recommendations not implemented yet. The first in the list is regarding redundant ISLs, recommending use of a second link between switches. This is a matter of the utmost importance for MCLAG InterControl Link, the ICL. After adding the links, the Manage for the Switch Topology view shows the new links automatically discovered and added to the ISLs. We go back to Security Rating and confirm that the recommendation is achieved. We move on to enabling MCLAG. This can easily be done by executing the command displayed in the recommendation. A security rating has already discovered the MCLAG peers. Go to FortiLink interface and disable split interface. The topology is updated with the active links and the MCLAG peer group. Back at security rating, we see that the recommendation is achieved. The next topology recommendation is to have redundant links from each switch to the FortiGate in order to improve redundancy and increase bandwidth. Two more ports are added to the FortiLink interface, one connected to each FortiSwitch. The links are automatically discovered and the topology is updated. Back at security rate, we confirm this recommendation is also achieved. Looking at the topology, we see that uplinks could be added between the access switch and one of the members of the MCLAG peer group. This would provide switch redundancy for the access switch. Just connect the links and the switch controller will update the topology. Lastly, we work on the final recommendation to lock down the 40 link stack topology. This is easily done by applying the changes in the GUI. FortiGate will change the LODP profile on edge ports to avoid that additional 40 switches are discovered unintentionally. The 40 link optimization is now complete. Thank you.